Hello everybody and welcome back to another mod review. Today we're going to take a look at a mod that basically converts four of the subsoilers in game into a plow function. Okay, so all of the subsoilers you see in front of you um, all cultivate or basically leave a cultivation texture but provide a plow bonus, meaning that they get rid of the need plow state but when they're done basically it looks like the field has been cultivated. That is not necessarily overly accurate, uh, given the way that these things operate. Uh, so this mod basically converts those four subsoilers into plows. It also will allow you to use these four to create fields, uh, which some people really like, because obviously it's a lot easier to use a nice, straight, squared off implement like this to create a field as opposed to one of the angled old bore plows. So let's go ahead and take a look at these in the shop. So if we go to subsoilers, okay, here are the base in-game subsoilers. And we're going to be talking about the combi plow gold 3 meter, 4 meter, Kuhn DC 401, and the Alta plow platinum 8 meter. Okay, so you can see this one is $7,000, 90 horsepower requirement, and is 3 meters. This one is 4 meters in width and 140 horsepower. And this one is 4 meters in width and 130 horsepower. And then you have the Culti Plow Platinum 8 meter. has 8 meter width and requires 420 horsepower. Plow. Huh. Horsepower. Okay. Now let's look at the modded versions of these. Got the gold three meter again, seven thousand, ninety five hundred, ten thousand, and eighty two thousand. Okay, so the prices are the same, but what's different is these act as plows. What's really awesome about this mod is it is super small. It's only uh, twelve KB in size, and you can get it at modhoster.com. The link is in the description below. So I've gone ahead and kind of set up. A, uh, a fleet of tractors and um, subsoilers here. So let's go ahead and get these things fired up. So we're going to start with the default um, subsoiler. You see when I hire the worker out, uh, they are basically leaving a cultivation texture. We'll go ahead and let these move on. See, they are leaving a nice cultivation texture here. Okay. Now, let's take a look at the modded versions. The first thing you'll notice, I've got a T8 as opposed to a T9. That's because this one, even though in the shop it still says 420 horsepower, it's actually been tweaked to uh, lower the horsepower requirement down to, I believe, 320 so here we've got the T8, and take a look. It says lower plow. The other is said lower cultivator, okay? And we've got the create fields. Why? To create fields and limit the fields. Let's go ahead and fire this guy off. And there we go. Got our plow state. Fire this one off. And we're plowing at three meters at seven miles an hour. Plowing four meters at six miles an hour. And another four meters at seven miles an hour. And we're using the small vulture for this. Using the Vultra N series. And uh, we've actually configured it to um, 201 horsepower for the 3 and 4 meter equipment. There you go. That is basically it, guys. So let me know in the comments what you think of this mod. 
Uh, let me know if this is something that you are into and everything. I think it's super cool. And the fact that it's really just a bunch of XML files. It's using all the in-game textures. It's going to keep your mod folder small, as efficient as possible. And it's simply just a bunch of XMLs to change the function from a cultivator to a plow. So guys, if you liked the video, please go ahead and click that like button. If you're not a subscriber, please go ahead and subscribe. We're going to do mod reviews um, throughout the week. So until next time, happy farming.